What up, it's 12 a.m. Thanks for watching Hollywire. Hollywire, we have 12 a.m. in the studio today. What up? Looking fresh Thank as you. hell. All right, let's do some rapid fire questions. Jesus, Just okay. gonna throw them at you. Let's go. You ready? Yep. Okay. Something you're really bad at. Uh, replying to text messages. I'm a FaceTimer, like I'm always FaceTiming yes. people. Something you never leave the house without. I mean, <laughs> my phone obviously, but, oh, the my headphones for sure. AirPods. Yeah, well, actually, AirPods? I, no, I don't, I used to do the AirPods, but I got the, uh, the Beats Pro now. First thing you do when you wake up in the morning. I actually open my laptop and record music. Favorite place you've ever visited? Uh, probably Denmark. Hidden talent. I'm a great dancer, yeah, that's can you do sure. the, Can you do the whoa? I said I was gonna retire can this I question. I have, I, you could throw it to me, yeah. Okay, you ready? Yep. There we go. Hey. You know what actually is, the, you know what's a funny story about Tyler? First time I met Tyler, uh, he was hitting the whoa like a hundred times in a row. And I was just like, I was like, what is it? Cause I didn't even really know what it was yet. I'm, so he's like the reason why I started doing the whoa. Girls with long hair or short hair? I like all oh, girls. I like, I like this. Is this short? Uh, yeah. Like medium. Um, okay, celebrity crush. It used to be, I still is, Selena Gomez. Really? Yeah, love that girl. Oh, uh, Pia Mia. Set it up, Pia Mia in 12 a.m. Hey, can I, uh, Jesse Reyes too. I would love to do a song with her. If you get, if you want to set it all this up. Okay, favorite social media app? Instagram. Okay, last one. Um, go to emoji. It's either the nail polish emoji or the little cute heart face that smiles. You had so many options with your name, like 2 p.m., 3 a.m., why 12 a.m.? Um, it was a close tie between 12 a.m. and 12 p.m. because I'm definitely a morning guy. Um, no, I'm kidding. But uh, no, nah, it's just like the type of music I make. It's like the shit you play at midnight. It's like you can get it, you can party do it, you can be in your feelings, so just like works. Best after party you've ever gone to post 12 a.m. Oh my god. I feel like you've been to some pretty cool events. After party? <laughs> the Hollywood's bleeding party was incredible. That 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 was insane. That was like it was it was at the Godfather's house. Uh, but you're on you're on that team, Post Malone, Tyler Yahweh. Will you be like collaborating with them? anytime soon, making music with them. What is that relationship like? Um, I mean, yeah, like definitely me and Tyler. Uh, we'll definitely get in and do some records together. And Tyler's like a big brother to me, so he treats me like a, you know, he's like always like, dude, you're next up. So uh, I love those guys and it's just like family. But for people who haven't listened to your music, how would you describe your vibe, your style? Your it's music? just like heartbreak trap R&B. You have a very like original style. Thank we you. We have to talk about it. All your tattoos. Um, on the it's crazy because when I came to LA, I didn't have any tattoos. Oh really? Yeah. So I got these so recently. I, I got my first tattoo by this is this is one of my favorites because it was done by Alex Michael Miller. You're, do you keep your nails polished all the time? Yeah, <clears throat> I get uh, yeah I get gels. I wanted to get some like nail art, so I got this happy and sad face. Okay, what about you? Something that you, the fans, wouldn't necessarily know. I'm super, super into NBA 2K. That's like the most competitive thing. So everybody who like, you know, is making music is playing 2K. I like always go like, there's really no one that can beat me in it. So like, if you do want to like, you know, go on PlayStation or Xbox, you can add me, it's RIP 12 AM. You can take an L if you want. Did sure. you play basketball? I mean, kind of. Like, I love okay. basketball. Like, I got Allen Iverson, the logo, like, tatted on me. Like, that yeah. was my idol. Music's your thing. Music is definitely my thing. Definitely yeah, what that's think. what we're doing. Um, right okay, so Love Dies, amazing. Maybe one of the best yet that you've put out. For sure. Yeah, that's like, I mean, the whole new album is on that direction. So, like, that's the sound we're going for. We definitely have some other styles in there, too. Like, I want to, like, you know, cross genres and like break boundaries and stuff. But yeah. Love Dies is like a special record for me. It was written on just guitar. It was me and Omer, the he's guitar incredible. player. incredible. Omer Fetty is the GOAT. Oh my God. No, he's a genius. Me and Omer were just in the studio, we're writing the song. 
And then Golden calls Omer and he's like, dude, I need to lay down a couple verses. Um, do you think, do you know anyone with a studio? And he's like, I'm literally with my boy 12, you should pull up. And that's the first time me and Golden ever met. So cool. And he heard the record and he's like, dude, this is crazy. Do you think I could hop on it? And I was like, hell yeah, dude. And he just one took his verse. First, first take, and I sat there. I was like, "Whoa, whoa, what? What did you just do?" <laughs> I had to like rewrite my shit. I was like, "Whoa, you just killed me on my own shit." Hold up, hold up. Whoa. You're amazing. This Thank was you, son. So You're fun. amazing. Thank you. I love this place. This is like, yeah. y'all need to come here. Come back anytime. A hundred percent. I'm gonna come back next week. <laughs> love dies. Go listen to it. Stream and it right now. Spotify, Apple Music, Deezer, all those. SoundCloud. Let's go. Love dies. All of it. For more, keep it right here, only on Hollywire. Whoa.